hi, this video may help somebody in the same situation um, that I found myself in. So we bought a new property and we live quite close to a road, as you can see. And what was happening is, as people were driving past, we could feel the vibrations in the floor upstairs. Um, so I did a bit of reading on this and it turns out that low frequencies travel through the building. And what we had was quite a, we have a wooden floor, as you can see up here, and these old Victorian joists that just run along it. And what was happening is when cars were traveling down, they were vibrating the house and the frequencies were, the low frequencies were traveling along these joists. Um, I found out for a bit of research and from reading some white papers that what you need to do is change the frequency from a low frequency to a high frequency. And the high frequencies, um, we're less susceptible as humans. We don't really sort of, in, we, we can't really feel them as much. So by changing the frequency, like you would on a guitar, right? If you think about putting your finger over a guitar at the very bottom of the thread, um, it changes the frequency. That's exactly what we've done here. So as you can see, what we've done is we put lots of um, noggins in. So these um, noggins in between the joists, connect them to, what that does is that's, that creates um, a higher frequency by joining everything together and making the floor much more um, solid and stable as it was before. So um, it's really noticeable. We've also added some, some rock wall up here as well as insulation. So hopefully um, this might help you. Um, it's been a bit of a been a bit of a process trying to find out the answer to this one, but it seems to be working so far. So I definitely can't feel the traffic anymore upstairs. So yeah, I'd highly recommend it. If you're having some issues with a, a wobbly floor or some traffic vibrations, um, maybe this is a, the thing for you.